VC2 Kiaji Market in Ijebode revealed their concerns are mounting over the escalating cost of essential school supplies as parents and guardians were busy buying one or other school necessities. The usual excitement of the back-to-school season is noticeably absent as it has been replaced with fear of affordability as buyers complained of high cost of school materials and noted that prices of goods have soared higher than usual since the removal of petrol subsidy. Actually, we all know what is happening in Nigeria. It has not been so easy, but uh, we don't have a choice other than um, to, because we cannot see our children will not be educated. We just have to strive and make it happen. Parents who have school, uh, school children, who are buying books, stationaries, and uh, other things for the students to go back to school. It's hard now. That is the, the reality. In fact, it is not easy at all. In fact, all the prices of things are on the high side. You come to market today, you buy things, maybe you buy a certain commodity at a particular price. When you come the following week, it's something else. School fees also on the rise as parents and guardians are feeling also the strain. The remaining one, God has already done it. So for the left, left for our leaders to do the needful so that things will be softer for the masses. People that are supposed to buy textbook. I mean big notes, two packs, three packs, they will buy three, just three pieces, six pieces, a pack, and they have five children, and they are saying that no money. The school administrator, who had assured parents of their readiness to receive their children back to school, urged them to prioritize their children's education by paying their school fees on time. Like now we have a um, hostel for those who cannot cope with the transportation, they can bring in their words introduce it, they calculate the transportation fee and what we have for the USA fee. You can bring in their words to save the situation. Yeah, the teachers are already taking, like they've already started their preparation by writing the lesson notes and the lesson plan they're actually going to teach them next week. The classrooms are well fixed uh, with gadgets that will make teaching and learning very easy for the pupils. They unanimously called on federal government to reduce fuel prices in order to ease the financial burden on families.